Like and subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon to get new video updates. Alistair Overeem abruptly retires, stunning UFC fans with truth behind dramatic weight loss. Alistair Overeem is now a vegetarian. Yes, the same hulking heavyweight who ate a diet of horse protein and TRT no longer eats meat. In fact, the former UFC contender is giving up many things, including martial arts, giving up his dramatic weight loss. Meat isn't he good for you. It is affecting you badly, Overeem told Love in Dubai. Yes, it tastes delicious. Even now, I could still eat meat. But I just decided against it. I started detoxing. I have this special nutritionist, Julian Van Hoven. When I met him, I knew right away that this was him guy has expertise. So we got to work, and I started taking these supplements at a relatively high dosage, that you can just take on an empty stomach. And after a couple of weeks my diet and appetite changed. I don't want that eat more. So the next day it was one less food. I ate a piece of steak that day, and the next day I didn't want to eat it anymore. When I spoke to Julian, I asked him what was going on. I don't want to eat my steak anymore, but I want to eat my steak because I want muscle. And he said, you had parasites in your body. We gave you the supplements. You start detoxifying your body, and these supplements are just algae. Anybody could take it. And it creates an alkaline environment that these parasites don't like. They get injured and die, and once you get rid of them, your taste changes over him said. It is not me who has to eat meat. It is the parasites that affect me and work through me to make me think I want to eat meat. But I am not, and once you get rid of them, it is you don't care. Fruit contains fructus. Healthy. Fruit does not produce acid. It alkalizes. We are designed to eat fruit. We re not designed to eat meat. So this acid-base ratio is also linked to cancer, and it s another way to prevent cancer. When you eat an alkaline diet, the cancer cells go away, you won't even get cancer. Folks, please ask your doctor not the ream about the best ways to prevent.